have two formulas which relate the variance of a combination of independent random variables x and y to the variances of the individual variables. Now if it bothers you that there's a plus in the right hand side of that second formula instead of a minus then you need to think a bit more carefully about what variance represents. One way to think of it is that variance measures the uncertainty in a random variable. So for example x might be the roll of a fair die and you don't know in advance what number you're going to get. The result is uncertain. You're combining that with another uncertain random variable, which means that the combination of those two things must be more uncertain than either of the original variables. And that's why you add the variances instead of subtract them. If that doesn't convince you, that's fair enough. We'll take a slightly more mathematical approach. We'll look at the distribution of x plus y when x and y are just independent rolls of a fair die. Now the largest result you can get only happens when you roll two sixes. So we get a sum of 12. The smallest result is if we roll two ones and it's much more likely that we'll get something in the middle. So for example all of these dice rolls lead to the same sum which is 7, much more likely. And the rest of the distribution looks like this. For x minus y, the largest result we can get is if x is 6 and y is 1. That's a difference of 5. The smallest result we can get is minus 5, and the distribution looks like this. As you can see, x plus y tends to produce larger values of the random variable than x minus y. However, variance is defined as measuring the spread of a distribution either side of its middle. So here are the middles of those two distributions. And as you can see, the spread either side of the middle in each case is exactly the same, which means the variance of x plus y and the variance of x minus y have to be the same. 